What's up everybody? Well, I got another gameplay video for you guys today, and today we're going to have a look at the forest again, but at 1440p. So, we are all set up and ready to go, as this is the laptop's natural habitat. All we did was take the cooler off. I have the, let's, what is it, I-E-T-S 500 cooler on my bed right behind me. I just take it off because it's not fair to make the laptop look better at cooling than it is. So, now, let's hop in and have a look at some settings. All right. Starting off the forest here at 1440p now. This time we are going to start at the ultra low preset, but figured we'd just show off the rest of these just display orientated settings, of which there's not many. So now let's go hop over and look at the ultra low settings. Okay, so here are the ultra low settings I forgot on 1080p, but we're not going to mess up no more. We're going to make sure we get it on all the rest of the resolutions. But all right, let's hop into the actual game. Well, all right, we're in the game at 1440p. Got ourselves our axe, now let's go around and eat. And this time we are doing ultra low. Didn't forget to do it this time, like I did on 1080p, so that is good. More food, more food. Oh, can, bottle, more bottle. Oh, more food, didn't really need it, but fuck it, we'll eat it anyway, we'll be a little gluttonous, cause we're not going to be able to have any more fun or food anymore. We're going to have to forage and do all that other nonsense. But I guess first yeah. let's uh, break some of these motherfuckers open. There's a rock. And a stick. You can do a lot of cool things with a rock and a stick. That's how the caveman used to hunt. That's right, I showed that fucking chair who's boss. Yeah, it won't show its face around here again, I can assure you of that. Oh, here's another one to open. Oh, I got some pills, apparently. That's what you want to do. If you're in a survival situation, start taking strange pills you find in suitcases. I mean, that's just awesome. But I know what they mean. It's probably supposed to be like uh, painkillers or something like that, but it just seems funny to just pick up strange pills out of a damn suitcase to me, but whatever, who cares? All right, though. I think that's... Well, can we actually chop this down? Yeah, we actually are making it... Stop. I'm actually gonna just chop this down real quick. I was gonna end the video, but because I didn't think that was actually gonna work. All right, now which way is the son of a bitch gonna fall? Don't fall on me. All right, which way are you going? Damn, that was loud. Well, anyone that's around is probably gonna come over here now. Yeah, I can pick up a log. Damn, this guy's like a superhuman. It's a pretty hefty log. All right, though, let's move on. Well, all right, guys, we're on very low, getting some camera gameplay now. There's a deer. Oh, shit, and there's a cliff right here. All right, well, I can't drink seawater, so I gotta find a water source. So I guess let's go find one. Oh, wait, there's one more thing to break open. Might even be more than that, but whatever. Huh. That is probably one of these colonies of those black people that will attack me, so I'm going to be very careful. Though it's not like they didn't hear a plane land in their backyard. So maybe that one's abandoned, but you can never be too careful in a survival situation, so let's go off this way instead. But before we do that, why don't we go ahead and up the graphics a little bit. Now we will move on to very low settings. 
because we're actually going in order this time, did not forget Ultra Low. So now let's go actually look at the settings themselves. And there we go. So with that, into the game we shall go. Well, now it's time for some ultra low gameplay. So let's get into it. Oh, mushrooms. Let's not eat the mushrooms. Eating mushrooms is a bad idea. Man, it's so much nicer to be able to, like, bend away from the mic when I have to, like, clear my throat and whatnot. or take a drink. When it was attached to my face, I didn't really have an option if I didn't want to hit the mute switch, and that would be a little weird. And then my luck, it wouldn't come back, and then I'd start talking and thinking I'm doing voiceovers, and it's like, no, you're not. You didn't get any of that, sorry. Anyway, let's move on. Now we're on very low instead of ultra low. So let's get ourselves a little bit of some gameplay in here. Alright, can I slide down here without injuring myself? Let's get some of this blood off. We can at least use the ocean for that. There we go, much better, much better. Now let's get the hell out of the ocean before I get attacked by a shark. Or in rust, that was the other one that I remember. I did do another one. Rust. I, I got killed by a boar that was underwater. That was pretty fucking interesting, to say the least. I wasn't even mad. I was more impressed. Like, hell yeah. Aquatic boar. Aquatic boar. Is that a dude just standing in the, uh... Air? Okay, no, he's on a ship. Or is that just a ship? It looks like there's a dude on it. Is that one of those crazy freaking black guys who wants to kill you? Or is that an actual, like, good dude? Wow, look at all these sharks. At least we found more luggage, though. All right, though. Why don't we go ahead and move on? Now, finally, just moving on to just regular old low. So, let's have a look at all the low settings. Hmm, seems like some don't have a low. They just go right up to medium, huh? All right. I'm using the preset, so whatever it wants to do is what we'll do. All right, and with that, game. All right, guys. I don't know about you, but I really want to see what's on this boat. Probably going to die, but fuck it. Even if we die, we'll just start all over from the start and just get more footage. Who cares? And it looks like we need water soon. But I'm not about to drink ocean water. That'll kill you really quick. But maybe there's some water on this boat. You never know. Oh, yep, see, there's sharks. Hmm, it's just called Betsy, huh?
We got a yacht boat, guys. And it's the fucking summer edition, no less. But all right, let us move on. All right, on to medium now. So let's go hop over here and look at all the medium settings. Because the quicker we do that, the quicker we can get back to the gameplay. Alright! Gameplay time it is. Well, here we are on the ship. Someone was missing. We got some money. Of some sort. More of that yacht magazine. We have a uh, head with a fork shoved in its mouth. That's, uh... That's always good. Hope we can't be holding any more of that. We got a skull and some random, like, entrails of humans. That's also good. That's what you want to find. That looks like a three, four-legged creature. Or people bound together. One of the two. Either way, not good. Want nothing to do with any of that. Ooh, are those air? Look like air. Bibles? Shit. Hey, we can save. Cool. That is just awesome. I didn't think I was ever going to get to save because I don't know how to make a fire and I... Red, that's how you make, that's how you do save. So hey, at least now we've always got a save point. We can just keep swimming past all the dangerous sharks every time we want to come save. That's okay with me. Oh, one more photo. What do we got? There's that bear again. Huh. And we can't get in there. We need to find some kind of key code or something. Or maybe some key. <laughs> Alright, now this is where the dude was standing. Alright, we get some rope. So that's good. More rope. Rope is useful in a survival situation. You can never have too much rope. Well, that's not true. Anyway, let's move on. Well, all right, we're on medium now, so I found myself a, uh, well, there goes one of those crazy people. But I found a place to save, so that's at least cool. It sucks I have to go through shark-infested waters to get to it, but it is what it is. All right, so to get back, there's a shark, but fuck it. I'm just gonna go, go, go. If I get killed by a shark, I get killed by a shark, and at least I save, so I can always reload. There's some coral down there too, jeez. But there was that crazy thing running away, so. That is not cool. Plus, it looks like it's going to be night soon. Yep, here he comes. Come on, yo bitch. Let's go. Oh, you don't want to fight? All right. I'm gonna kill you. Ow. Oh shit, now I'm getting killed by both of them. All right, high settings time it is, so let's go over to this graphics tab here and have a look at what all the high settings are. All right, there we go. Let's get back into that game. Well, all right, let's get some high gameplay in now. We just escaped a predicament that we did. We certainly can't run anymore, that's for sure. I guess we should find some food and shit. Alright, let's go down here and see what there is. 
Seems like mostly a bunch of fucking rocks. And water. Alright, we're not being followed, at least to my knowledge. Just because I don't see nobody there doesn't mean they're not just hiding. Those black creatures are everywhere. It's not like I can run away from them. But let's move on. Well, alright. Moving on. Hi, I got captured by some crazy people. They're probably going to eat me. Man, you never know where more of those guys are going to pop up, and I have no stamina, so I doubt I can fight them off. I need to find some water and eat something. That's what it's looking like. But before that, why don't we go ahead and max the game completely out? Well, alright guys, we're going to max the game completely out now. So let's hop over here and see what all that is. Okay, and with that, we can hop into the game and see how it does. Well, here we are, getting some max gameplay now. Still plenty of FPS. Random stutter here and there, but nothing too crazy. And I can definitely say they definitely improved the DirectX 11 drivers quite a bit. Let's go clean ourselves up. At least a little bit. Man, it's really annoying not being able to run. Needs food soon, too. <coughs> Little bit of water, but mostly food. So probably just doesn't have the energy to run. No one's following me. Good, good. Whoa, check this giant asshole out. Oh, a new item was added to to-do list. I wonder what it was. All right, let's not fall down into the giant hole. That would not be good. That would not be good at all. All right, then, let's move on. All right, guys, we're all maxed out now. Fortunately, I haven't found any food. Okay. Where can we go to find the food? The magical food that keeps me alive. Here's a tent of sorts. Alright, so you can't break into the tent. Alright, well, I figured it was worth a shot. Figured maybe there was leftover food and shit. And we still get a random little 
blip of lag every now and again, but beyond that, it plays very good. But all right. Why don't we go ahead and move on? Well, that is a wrap for the forest at 1440p and it handled it flawlessly. There is a random bit of stutter every now and again. it will just have one quick little, just a little quick stutter, but it does it every once in a blue moon. So it doesn't really bother me, but want to be truthful. So it does have that little problem, but it is a DirectX 11 game. Even though they patch it and stuff, it's usually going to be more problematic than DirectX 12. But then DirectX 12 loves to have pre-caching problems on games that don't pre-crash their shaders. And then you get into stutter fest. So that's not fun either. It would be just ever so great if they could just make a game smooth. They used to be back in the day. I don't know what's happened, but being flawlessly smooth shouldn't be an issue, especially for a beastly laptop like that. Anyway though, I'm blabbing on and on. Time for us to end this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and until the next one, peace out guys.